Tonight, a Sumner County teenager faces charges for having a pipe bomb. News Channel 5's Adam Gassimi is in our newsroom with the latest on how police found it, Adam. Hey, Rory, investigators say the boy's mother actually called them on Friday because he had been acting out and then revealed she had searched his vehicle and found the bomb. I would never have guessed <laughs> something like that would happen in this neighborhood. Today, neighbors told us about their complete surprise when they suddenly saw police everywhere. Some homes on Oak Hill Drive in Portland had to be evacuated and the street was shut down, but they couldn't find any bomb making materials. THP's bomb technicians tell us it was a functioning pipe bomb made of a six inch galvanized steel pipe with end caps and a fuse and had black powder inside. They were able to detonate it safely. Portland detectives say the boy told them the bomb was made in another other county, so tonight they are trying to figure out if there are other devices and who else could be involved. The teen, who we are not identifying because he is a minor, is facing charges for having the explosive and being unruly. Neighbors are just happy the boy's mother did the right thing. There's too much out there in this world uh, to entice kids to do the wrong thing, and when parents are on top of it, they get these messages, they get this idea that there's something going wrong. They better check up on it. And today, the boy's mother declined to comment. Police do not believe the pipe bomb was built to hurt anyone. In the newsroom tonight, Adam Gassimi, News Channel 5 HD.